Wow, everything is frozen over. You said Ignis's core is here. Is that the Centurion of Ice? No, fire. Wait, fire? But this place is freezing! I believe the core's loss of control is having a negative effect. The Centurion's power is working in reverse. So that's why it's so cold in here. Fire. What are you thinking, Rain? You said that there was a Centurion of Light in the basement of the Tower of Mana. That's right, but Lloyd took it from us. It seems that the Centurion's cores are located in the same places where the Summon Spirits used to be imprisoned. Tenebrae, are Centurions and Summon Spirits related in some way? No, nothing of the sort. Though Centurion's cores are located in places with unusually high concentrations of mana, the Centurions use their elemental attributes to counterbalance these mana anomalies. So, wouldn't that mean we'll find Centurion's cores by visiting all the places where the Summon Spirits were? There's no need to follow Lloyd. I was just thinking the same thing. Really? Maybe we can beat Lloyd to the cores now. I'm not sure about that. Lloyd knows where the Summon Spirits were located as well. If he's realized this, it doesn't give us any advantage. There's no way I'm losing to Lloyd. Genus. I understand how you feel, but the only one who can erase Emile's doubts about Lloyd is Lloyd himself. I know that, but it's still difficult. Ignis is now awake. As Ignis's powers return, Emil, as a knight of Ratatosk, you should also awaken to new powers. So, um, now we need to recruit fire elemental monsters. That would gradually bring back Ignis's powers. And I should get stronger too, right? in order to save this world. We have to find all of the Centurion's cores so that we can wake up Ratatosk. Please, give us Lumen's core. All right, that's enough. 
hand over Ignis's core. Marta, we have to take back Lumen's core by force. Why even try to reason with this murderous man who killed innocent people in Palma Costa in cold blood? Come on, Lloyd. You have to tell them. Tell them that you didn't attack Paul Macosta. All of these rumors about you. You didn't do any of that stuff, right? <sighs> Come on, Lloyd. Please answer me. Yes, Lloyd. Is there something you can't tell us? What is it? Or perhaps the rumors about you are true. I don't have to answer you. Now then, hand over the Centurion's core. If you refuse me, I won't hesitate to take it by force. But Lloyd! Why? This is for those you killed! Die! You still have much to learn. Wait a minute! Lloyd, wait! Ah! This doesn't look good. That monster is blind with rage. Damn it! Here it comes!
changes your whole personality, on top of giving you new powers. Indeed. I'm sure Emil has his hands full simply controlling the power he receives from Ratatosk, which is why he often can't control his own emotions. Then he's just like Rain when she's in ruin mode, giving in to her desires, unable to control her maniac urges. Ow, that hurts! Just like me. Could that mean he has another self sealed away inside him? If so... What's wrong? It's nothing. 